When your friend is doing their homework in the library and you're just sitting there and you have and you think you have nothing to do, grab a don't grab a book and read it until your friend is done with their homework or just do your homework at the library. Right? I mean, I understand we all get bored, but you should never rush your friend because they might have an assignment they have that's really important that they want to try and get done. And it's just not fair to them. So always be considerate and maybe do your homework at the library. So then you have something to do to keep you busy while you wait for your friend to finish part of their assignment that they're doing at the library. <laughs> Hi everybody, it's Mina. Welcome back to my channel, or if this is the very first video that you're seeing of me, then welcome to my channel. Please be sure to hit that subscribe button down below if you didn't already. I post every day except for Tuesday and Friday afternoon sometimes, and today in this video, I have another story time. Yes, I'm doing a lot of story time, and this is my fifth video of the day, but I wanna get this uploaded and done because it's gonna take me a bit to upload. So today I have a story about the time I accidentally rushed my friend to come home with me because um, I wanted to go home, and but little did I know was she had a really huge assignment she needed to get started on in the library, and she wanted to try and get as much done as possible. And then I felt bad, kind of, kind of bad later because I didn't know because she didn't tell me, but I felt bad rushing her to get her son to get home to to my house because. She, because um, I wanted to get home before my parents did, because like I said, I didn't have a cell phone at the time. So this is a story just to teach you guys. If your friend has an assignment that they have to do at the library, maybe you should pull out your homework and start doing it so then you don't complain and say you wanna go home and get bored because it's not fair to your friend because they need to get their assignment done. done. And if you're just sitting there bored and complaining, then just go home by yourself. But if you want to walk home with your friend, but they're starting an assignment in the library, why don't you just do your homework in the library? So just keep in mind, I understand it's kind of annoying to wait for people, but maybe you should do something to occupy yourself like your homework and just get it done so then you can get it over with. So I'm going to get started and I hope you guys enjoy the video. And because I won't be using names for safety purposes, we're going to give my friend a name and call her library homework because she wanted to do her homework in the library. So this all started about 19 years ago. I was in the seventh grade. I was all ready to go home. And my friend, who I'm gonna name library homework because she wanted to do her homework at the library, um, decided she wanted to go to the library really quick after school. And I don't know why I didn't ask why, but I was just confused of why she wanted to go to the library. But, very, but I wanted to get home before my parents did because I wanted them to know that I got home safely. So I decided, but I decided to be flexible anyway and go to the library really quick with, um, library homework or whatever I decided to name her. Um, so I decided to go to the library with her. Um, give me one second. I do apologize. I had to answer and answer a family text. Anyway, um, so my friend library homework decides she wants to go to the library. Yes, I named my friends weird things, but that's the only name I could think of because she wanted to go to the library to do her homework. So I've got not so not thinking. I decided to go with library homework to do homework to the library. So I'm sitting there with her and we're sitting there for quite a while, maybe about 20 minutes and I kind of get bored and I ask her if we could go home in a little bit and she goes, sure, sure, just a little bit. So I kind of start getting bored and I'm not thinking and I'm getting a little antsy because I want to get home before my parents did. And at that time I didn't really have like a concept of time and I was worried because the last couple times that I 
um, didn't get home before my parents. They weren't too happy about it. So I didn't know what time my mom would get home at the time because she worked as a teacher at the time. And my stepdad at the time, he worked as a realtor. So I didn't know what time either of them were going to be home. So, but I wanted to get home so bad before they did. So I was getting a little antsy. So I asked my friend library homework if we could leave now. And she Start, she's not too happy because I'm kind of pestering her to leave and um she and then I ask a third time I get I feel bad because I'm getting super annoying at this point I go can we please just go home I'm worried about my parents getting home and she goes fine we can just go home but I have a huge assignment that I need to start on maybe next time why don't you do your homework so then you're not so antsy to leave and I literally start to feel bad so we get our stuff packed up and just go straight home and um once we get home I um, once we get back to my house I apologize to library homework about that I was just worried about getting home before my parents and she go and she was really nice and cool about it and she was super understanding and then she told me that if I got if I didn't was just sitting there, I should have done my homework while she was doing her assignment. So then it would have been a lot easier. So I followed her advice and I decided to do that. So the very next, I think it was the very next day, we decided to just hang out. Was it the very next day or was it the very next week? Um, the very next day or the very next week, um, I decide to do my homework at the library while library homework is working on her assignment, which is due, I think, in a few weeks. So it made it a lot easier for her to enjoy being at the library. And it also made it easier so I had something to do so I wouldn't complain the entire time, which I thought was a really good idea. So I started doing my homework in the library if library homework wanted to go to the library to do her assignment. So the moral of the story is you should always be doing your homework if your friends are doing their homework at the library. Don't wait till you get home to do your homework. I understand it's called homework <laughs> because you want to do your homework at home. <laughs> give that video, give this video a thumbs up if you thought that was funny. So anyway, um, so just do your home. And if you're getting a little antsy and you're bored, just do your homework at the library so then you don't have to think about it when you get home because it makes it easy because it has it's something for you to do because it keeps you busy so your friends can do their homework at the library too. And it just makes it fun because then you get to not only only hang out with your friend, but you can get your assignment done before you get home. So keep that in mind. Always just work on your homework while your friends are working on their homework at the library instead of getting impatient and antsy like I did that one time. So that was a story about how I rushed my friend to leave our school library. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you so much for watching. Please be sure to like and subscribe if you haven't already. I post every day except for Tuesday and Friday afternoon sometimes and I'll see you in another video soon. Bye. Don't forget to like this video if you enjoyed it and subscribe. So this all began about 19 years ago. I was in the seventh grade. It was after school. My friend wanted to go to, decided she wanted to go to the library. So because she had an important assignment, assignment, um, that she needed to do. Well, I didn't know that. So let me start that over.